16.5, the director of the CrossFit Games, Dave Castro. Did anybody hear me say thrusters in row earlier to George? Our goal is fitness. Our goal is to increase your work capacity. I flew out here to see Rich, and he made me test the workout before him. So that's how he treats his guests. Uh, Friday. He just went bleh, so I guess he's not feeling well. I'm gonna go hard in the beginning, hard in the middle, and then hard at the end. Oh, why, why don't we do them all like that, right? <laughs> oh, there's my mom. So, so this is my mom. Yeah, I gotta get out. Mom, this is CrossFit. Hi. <laughs> she did the workout this morning. 14. That's awesome. 14 flat. Do you know what Rich got yet? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I seriously don't know, but I'm communicating with Ebert. He doesn't want me to tell the world what he got. And I'm having journalistic qualms with this. Do I report the news or do I help my friend? Let me see, what do you think, Ian? The score stays confidential, right? Yeah. Rich will not help. Don't believe him, Matt. And I just pray that you help us perform to the best of our ability today for your glory and honor. Amen. 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 At this point, it's like you're here. Juices are flowing. Everybody's here. We might as well just fucking put the music on and get after it. It hurts! I'm not doing that again. I'm not redoing that again. No way. I don't care what somebody comes in with. My quads are locked. So bad. Uh. Man, I can't. Oh. I was like, I actually thought that you were actually gonna drop it. I want somebody to cut my legs off. I'm not redoing that shit. No fucking way. Is that bad? It hurts so bad. So we finished the workout. As you can see behind me, he's ruining my selfie here. Um, he's not feeling well. I've never seen him act like this. He's cramped. He's tripping. He's straight tripping. Uh, oh, I can't get my shoes. I'm not redoing that one. Thank you.
my god, Alex is here. I would have, I would have sandbagged the shit out of that if he wasn't. I don't know if I've ever gone that hard on a workout. I honestly, I don't think I could go any faster knowing how bad it hurt. Did you shave your chest today? Uh, last night. Trimmed it. I don't grow good chest hair, is why. If it was like, like fraser has got good chest hair. I can't do that, I can't pull that off. You know? I don't have it. What did Rich get? Fuck, did he beat me? Did he beat me? <laughs> yeah. Cut the camera. Do you know his time? Yes. Yes? <laughs> he he te he texted the, the group and said, Alright, I killed the drama, I'm not doing that again. I asked him how it, what was his time. <laughs> yeah, right. Well the fact that the fact that you won't even tell me if I beat him or not makes me makes me think that he beat me. I, I, I don't know, like even if he beat me, I, I don't think I could I don't think I can go faster. This isn't a power queen. I don't think that's how you do that. Hey, Chief. I, I think I think that's the most terrifying thing, like when like for me, like it, when, when I complete a workout like that, that's the scariest feeling knowing like if someone beat me and it's not like I can go back and strategize it differently or pace this part, pace that part, go faster here, go faster there. It's like, no, like I, I hit everything perfectly for, for me and that's still not adequate. That's I think the scariest feeling in the world. I told him, I said, I laid in the parking lot for about 20 minutes after, and he said, yeah, me too. He still won't tell me his time. <laughs> Come on, what was Rich's time? <laughs> what did, so wait, 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 what did he say in the text thread? My arm's huge. Intimidation factor. 5.30, so. And I, I said, yeah, Alex got 5.30. Like, he went like a bat out of hell. Did you beat that time? <laughs> and he said, no, I did not. Did you? And I asked him, I was it depends. Are you redoing it? <laughs> and I haven't heard back yet. We Olympic lift every day except for Friday. We run, we swim. So we figured Friday's non-functional Friday. Let's have some fun after the open workouts. I don't know if we'll keep doing it after the open, but... Intimidation factor when Lakeland starts dating, you gotta have big arms. Did, did you ever see, uh... Wait, did I leave my keys in the car? Oh shit. I may have locked my keys in the car. Yeah, locked the keys in the car. Probably in the ignition. Yep. Literally in the ignition? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> shit. That, that's the only set of keys I have, too. What's the logic between the two slices folded? Do you eat it fast? No, because you're not limited by like how thick the bite is. You're only limited by how much you how deep you're going in your mouth.
between chicken legs and ostrich legs? Ostriches. What do you mean have, there's no difference? Ostriches have pretty There's a substantial so difference. Tall. <laughs> I'm not talking about length. You We're talking about no, girth no, here. I'm Ooh, sorry, that's a long me. one. Yeah. <laughs> I get it? No. Did we get it? Yeah. Oh. oh. Look at how long that was. <laughs> Did you just pull that, that out so of his great. nose? Good, right? I, I, I text Rich. I said, hey, how's it going? And his response was only, I'm not doing it again. <laughs> so I'm not doing it again. He's not doing it again. What was his time? <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> We're not friends anymore. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fun finding a ride back to the gym. She loves him, actually. Can you make that noise? That was the most I've ever done by awesome. a long shot. <laughs> <laughs> so what was Richard's time? Is it already 7 30? Yeah. Oh man. Alright. Guess I'll finish up rowing real quick. Check the leaderboard first and I'll get yeah. back on the road. <laughs> of course. Which one was the last time you checked the leaderboard? Last night, maybe? Now, now it starts. Now it starts. Is Rich up? You can scroll over. Richard Froning. I think you got 519. 519? Where'd you get? 518. 535. That was the secret that I had to hold in all weekend. <laughs> Did, oh, is that his original time? Yeah, he didn't redo it. Really? Yeah. This is your first individual competition that you have won since 2011. Mm hmm. I'm not competing as an individual, so it doesn't really matter. I mean, it matters, but it doesn't. Looks like he's just locked up the open victory, and that is Matt Fraser. Matt, thank you so much for being here, and first of all, congratulations on the win. Thanks, guys. Would I like to win? Like to win? Yes. Am I upset that I didn't win? Not really. I mean, what do you think? Feels good. Hard work. It's just hard work paying off. It, it feels good no matter what, what it's in. Yeah. You know, you make fun of me for buying clothes and like watching the computer and time and whatever else. This is the exact same thing. No, no it's not. Way. Yes, no it is. Look at it. Way. He's been glued to his phone the whole yeah, time. Yeah, but he's not spending any money. If he could, he would. Like on what? A better score. <laughs> <laughs> Take that, James. You wanna go row? <laughs> Is that what you're gonna do? <laughs> no, I've rowed enough. <sighs> what do you think of your son? <laughs> I am I am absolutely amazed. I wanted to tell him how fabulous that is. Oh, as, as you can see, what, what time is it? 8 15 at night. Congrats. Thank you. And she's over there working. <laughs> no, I was refreshing the leader. <laughs> I was going to have an ulcer if they didn't put your name on there somewhere. <laughs> oh, I'm really, we're, Dan and I are both really proud of him. That's cool. He works hard. <laughs> yeah, go row. <laughs> <laughs> now work harder. <laughs> you won by 11 points. Yeah. You should get back downstairs.